Hello, welcome to Miss G's Art. We just finished watching a video about Frida Kahlo and Dia de los Muertos or Day of the Dead. So we will combine the two together. So we will make our own sugar skull or calaveras uh, out of our paper. This will look like when it's finished. So we first will draw the skull's head. We will draw the two circles first, nice and big. Kind of near the top of your paper. And try to make them as close to the same size as you can. Then I'm going to flip my paper upside down. And near right here, I'm going to draw a heart. And we'll flip our paper over. And we just made our skull's nose. The next thing we'll do to the top of the skull is just a nice giant rainbow line. So I'm going to go up and around. Next, we're going to draw two diagonal lines from the side, can go in about halfway to the eye. Go on and in. The next thing, draw a nice U shape because this is top of the head, the little cheekbone. Now we're just gonna draw the jaw. Draw a nice U shape. Mine's very square, but you don't have to be very square for yours. The next thing is gonna draw the mouth. So this is gonna be really easy. You could draw it straight or kind of like it's smiling. It's up to you. Then the next thing, we'll draw one, kind of like plus signs, one in the middle, kind of the longest. Then on the right side, you can draw two shorter lines and repeat on the other side. The next step is draw the teeth. So you're just drawing rainbow lines again, just connecting. Then repeat again, just drawing U shapes. Awesome. Then, after you got your shape down, mine's really big, but you can always make your lines a little bit shorter to make it smaller. Or if you choose not to, you could just do just the straight lines. Then you're going to outline your skull with something black. It could be a Sharpie, black color pencil, black crayon. This help pop out the features of the skull because when you do the color part, this help it makes it stand out. Next step is, is the fun part. You get to personalize your sugar skull by adding different designs to it. And also you could do flowers, circles, different things to help it match with Frida Kahlo. You will add flowers because she always wears flowers in her hair. So figure out how you will add a flower to it. Are you going to try to hide it? See if you can find it. Or you could add it on top. That's fine too. So you could add lots of different colors. I did a little bit of an ocean themed. I did some seashells, heard some jellyfish, some bubbles. It's up to you. Because once you're done designing out your sugar skull and coloring, you will cut it out. You can glue it on colored paper or you stick with this paper. This is perfectly fine. And if you want to add flowers to the background or to cut it out like I did, I just drew some on the background of the paper and I was color it and cut it out. You could do any style of flowers. I did just a circle and just use shapes. I like how we did our sunflowers. Or you can have different types of flowers. Maybe you want to do a rose. And you could do a swirly line. Then do a U shape connecting and have a rose. Have fun.